There she is, my favorite superstar! What now? First off, love this energy. Tough, no nonsense, brutal. It's working. Secondly, how would you feel if I said Minneapolis, money in the bank, you, Piper Niven, in the ring, making magic happen? What's the catch? No catch. I just think we should reward a superstar who has earned a big opportunity with the big stage. Then why are you sweating? Okay, fine. You want the truth? You terrify me. These days, whenever I'm within about 20 feet of you, I just naturally and instinctively clench. So I thought maybe if you had a reason to like me, it would make it less likely that you'd take out all your inner turmoil on my outer face. Plus, you deserve it. Truly. So what do you think? Money in the bank? I should have struck fear into your heart earlier. I want the match. Great. It'll be great. Cap is where it's at. So we're good, right? As long as you stop sniveling. I... will try. You're doing well for yourself, I see. Star locker room vibes. <laughs> the legend graces us with her presence. I like my decor to reflect my personality, which is abrupt and impatient. What do you want, Justine? I want to talk about Psycho Sally. What about her? She eating solid food yet? So hard, aren't you? She is. She's eating solid food, and she's back in the ring. Good. Good. So long as she stays out of my way. I'm sure she will. I can't imagine she wants to lay her eyes on you again. You hurt that girl. Not just physically. I wasn't... I had to show Rhea. It's a brutal world, and Sally had to learn that the hard way. The hard way, being the woman she trusted most in the world, beating her within an inch of her life on national television? Unless you're looking to learn a lesson in brutality yourself, get to the damn point. She's on NXT this week in her first televised match back. I thought you might appreciate the update. I can report back if you'd like to know how she's doing. Sally was in the wrong place at the wrong time. I regret nothing, but I don't wish her harm. Let me know if she's okay. Huh. There is a little of you left in there. Same person I've always been, Justine. Maybe. I'll let you know how Sally does. Get ready for the untamed and unashamed Psycho Sally. The following contest is scheduled for one fall. Making her way to the ring from Las Vegas, Nevada, Psycho Sally. Recruited by the legendary Justine at WWE Triumph. Come straight out of high school to NXT, Thea has made it clear she doesn't want her youth to define her. Yeah, Thea Hill wants to prove that she really is a grown woman who can hold her own. And that means no more waiting, no more asking for permission. Time to stop being a student and start teaching lessons. Thea Hale is a true ball of... 
Sheva Sally still seems to be searching for herself out there. It takes a long time for the echo of the trail to finally fade, Michael, both physically and mentally. She needs to find a way to silence that and get her head on straight. Or else, one of these days, her opponent's gonna knock it right off. Turnbuckle's the only thing keeping her upright. The ability to take risk with minimal trepidation. No fear, absolute reckless abandon. A slingshot! Face buster! No doubt, Thea's having trouble here. Any of Thea Hale's defenses have been pegged. Looking wobbly in the corner. With the counter! Momentum isn't completely out of Hale's side just yet. Yeah, Thea's survival instincts are taking over. She got her down. Is this it? She kicks out with authority. Keeping a loss at bay for now. Right in the chest. What a drop kick. What are we going to see next? What a leg drop across the rope. That maneuver goes to show you how much speed kills. A running Hurricane Rana. A running Swanton. Uh-oh, springboard into the coup de gras. Are you kidding me? Oh, what a kick to the face. Oh, my God. Thea embroiled by her opponent. Incredible. Two. Psycho Sally gets the win. Here is your winner, Psycho Sally. Thea Hale put away in this one. Thea Hale still has a lot to learn in this industry, and this loss proves it. I'm sure she'll take this loss as a learning opportunity. Hey, Carly. How's it going? How's it going for you? Great win out there, but honestly, you didn't seem like yourself. Not very, you know, psycho. Honestly, psycho is looking a little aspirational these days. Right after I started training, I saw this match Cab had with La Suspira. This war. They climbed up and started fighting in the balcony. Cab catches her with a kick to the gut, looks out at the crowd. And she hits a freaking Canadian destroyer off the ledge like 15 feet down through a table. It was absolutely psycho. And it was all in the world I wanted to be. Aw, that sounds insane. And fun. And the kind of stuff you should be doing right now, Sally. Maybe. But I can't stop thinking about how the person who inspired me so hard took me out of action for weeks. You can't let what Cap did get in your head. <laughs> now she tells me. Ha! <laughs> Listen, we've both been kicked in the teeth by adventure recently. What do you say we turn it around and give a little back? What you have in mind? Psycho Sally, I just won a match by straight up cheating. Held my opponent's tights. One, two, three! And you know what? Tell me, tell me. It felt like taking back control from all the Caps and Rias of the world. Let's feel that way together. You want to, like, be a tag team? Actually, I already jumped way out on a limb and got us booked in a match with JC Jane and Cora Jade. 
You booked me in a tag match without even asking me? You know what I call that? Eww, a poor choice that crossed your personal boundaries? Freaking psycho! Let's go get crazy, Carly. It's Psycho Sally, the maven of mayhem and madness. The following is a tag team match set for one fall. Introducing first, from Las Vegas, Nevada, Psycho Sally! It's time to get psycho, Corey. I wish. For a person who calls herself Psycho, Sally had better find that edge, or her opponent tonight is going to send her right back to the asylum. No need to check your watches. It is prime time. And her partner, Carly Prime. Carly Prime is the prototype of a blue chip athlete. And we've seen them come and go how many times over the years, Saxton? Running around in the grass is not enough to make a WWE superstar. Will Carly be the next? They are brought together by a common enemy. Now we find out if that shared betrayal is enough to propel them to success in the ring. Both Carly and Psycho have looked a bit vulnerable as of late, so it's not surprising they're looking to pair up and get the targets off their backs. Unless they end up just putting two targets right next to each other. Ah, oh, gets cracked by the overhand. Spin kick to the midsection. She's pushed into the corner. Jane reverses it. She's got an answer for that. Sally is out of the way. Running Hurricane Rana. Fantastic. Agility like that is what can set you apart from the rest of the locker room. Moonsault. Things taking a turn for her now. Yeah, that's Psycho Sally putting her in-ring acumen to good use. Knee left right to the face. Holy moly, amazing display of athleticism. Quick reflex is so important in a match like this. She's able to make it. Oh, kick to the face. We just might see! Standing Spanish Flyer, are you kidding me? Incredible. Perhaps looking for some kind of equalizer here. And here comes Old Faithful. The steel chair is in hand. Saw that one coming. Brutal forearm. And Sally is keeping the match at her pace. Yeah, Jade has to find a response quickly. The official making clear this is, in fact, not that kind of match. Placed into the corner. to Psycho Sally's corner. It's time for her to take advantage of that misstep and take command. No telling what she'll find under the ring here. Two. 
And she dodged that one nicely. Wow, that was pretty psycho out there, Carly. I know, that felt freaking incredible! Did you hear the sound the chair made when it made contact? Wham! Do you think it was really necessary to hit anyone with a chair? Was it necessary for Cap and Rhea to do what they did to us? Easy, easy, I'm on your side. We were amazing together. We should, we should, we should get a tag title opportunity. Oh, I mean, that would be nice, but we've only had one match. That's why... That's why we need to attack Isla and Alba. Wait, what? Yeah! We attack the tag team champions, they're bound to give us a title shot. That always works. Sure. We could also ask... We should make a statement, just like Cap and Rhea did. We can show the whole NXT locker room, the whole WWE, that we are not going to be pushed around ever again. I mean, yeah. Yeah. Let's do it. Let's go absolutely psycho on them. Maybe no chairs, though. I make no promises. Another successful tag team title defense for Isla Dawn and Alba Fire. Hold on, that's Carly Prime and Psycho Sally. And they're attacking the champions from behind. What's this all about? Carly and Sally are the new team on the block. Maybe they want to establish themselves by going after the champs. It's worked before. When we see the dark duo of Alba Fire and Isla Dawn, we're looking at a team who's hungry and on the hunt for victims. When you call yourself the Unholy Union, you're not exactly mentoring rookies. This team's not just dangerous. These women no way. are able to interrupt the attack. That's playing fast and loose with your own body. That is weaponizing your body. That's what that was. Ouch. Unbelievable athleticism. It takes a certain level of athleticism to pull that off. Oh, man, meeting the barricade. Oh, look at this claw on the face. Prime example of working smarter, not harder. That's what I say. A running hard Colorado. Fatigue must be getting to her. This is getting hard to watch, guys. We might need to stop this one. Ooh. Oh, what a kick. Ooh. I don't know what they're looking for here. And she's wasting no time kicking things up by bringing this chair into play. Holy cow! That chair came in on them fast. Ooh, she just turned it around. And it looks like she wants to take this match outside. Bang. Never saw it coming. And that will do it. Not getting up from that one, so it's called.
Guess you heard? <laughs> Damn right I did. What did I tell you? We beat Isla and Alba down an instant title match. Yep. Worked out just like you said. And it felt so good. Cap and Rhea, they're really onto something. Brutality. Brutality is the way to success. It's like a shortcut. It is. It's a shortcut, Carly. An electric shortcut. I feel so powerful. No, no you don't. You feel like a bully. And that's not power. That's Cap and Rhea's kind of power. Uh, yeah? After what they did to us, isn't that what you want? Maybe at first I did. At least a little bit. Now that I've tried it, I realize it doesn't fit. It doesn't fit me, and it doesn't fit you. But... We got a title opportunity. And we are gonna go out there and do crazy moves Alba and Isla have never seen in their lives and beat them in the middle of the ring. We will fight every bit of their fire with fire. We will go psycho! Hell yeah! But what we won't do is anything like Cap and Rhea. Because they're not psycho. They're a pair of lunchroom bullies. That's not brutality. That's weakness lashing out. And we are not weak. No, we're freaking not. So let's go win the tag team titles and prove it. A tornado of thrills, a whirlwind of wrestling, Psycho Sally. It's time to get Psycho, Corey. I wish. For a person who calls herself Psycho, Sally had better find that edge, or her opponent tonight is going to send her right back to the asylum. It's a must-watch fury with the up-and-coming Carly Prime. Some of the best athletes from the toughest sports in the world try their luck in WWE and run right back home with their tail between their legs. Will you stop it, Corey? Carly is not the type to run from any kind of fight. The following contest is a tag team match scheduled for one fall. It is for the WWE Women's Tag Team Championship. Introducing the challenger. The team of Psycho Sally and Carly Prime. And their opponents, the team of Isla Dawn and Elba Fire. The WWE Universe. You would expect this to be a colossal challenge to the reigning champions as they go head to head against a pair that is becoming the most brutal force in the business. But these two tag champions are here for a reason. I doubt they're going to get rattled by Carly Prime and Psycho Sally's antics. It's more than just antics, Corey. These two challengers have shown they're fully capable of making just as much noise fairly as they do outside the rules. Oh, ouch! She avoids the attack completely. Kidneys. Golly. Just one step ahead. Oh, God. Yeah. 
Sally is out of the way. And Isla didn't figure out a defense for that maneuver. Yeah, Psycho Sally reminding her opponent she's not someone to take lightly. Ah, uh, snapmare. Oh, face first. Bang! And another. Oh, 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 oh. foot meet face. Spiked into the ring apron. Uh-oh, fails to connect on the springboard. Uh-oh, uh-oh. Vaughn with a nice turnaround. John Stump. An attempt for the championship. And she's able to stop the count early. She is showing us something special here tonight. Getting set up for something in the corner. She's up on that top turnbuckle. She won't be for long. And Sally is countered. Big impact. She flips it back on her. Sidekick on the mark. Showing some extra scouting, knowing how to answer a counter with a counter of your own. Forearm! What are we going to see next? Nice shot right across the back of the neck. Ouch. Oh, look at this. I don't want to be part of these problems. Don't want to be part of this crowd. Springboard coup de gras. The champ not in a great place. Yeah, they stuck it out through this match, but it wouldn't hurt to go for the tag soon here. Somehow she's still in this matchup. It's unbelievable. Time for her to go home. Oh, no, wait a minute. Oh, and quick resiliency from the challenger. What a jaw-dropping show of strength this late into the match. Brutal knee to the side of the face. She's on unsteady legs in the corner. Needs to recover. Quick exchange. Revert the champion into the cover. Shoulder up right away. Incredible power to kick out at just one. The lunar combo. This could be an opportunity. Not where you want to be right now. Ah, uh, Cobra Clutch! Cutthroat side slam. Able to tag her partner. What a response from Sally. O'Connor roll. Shoulders are down. This could be it. Here's the pin to retain. Cover for the championship. And she breaks the count. Somehow still in this fight. Not down and out yet. Kick right to the face. She is queuing it up again. Standing Spanish flyer. Are you kidding me? Incredible. She denies pride. With the going bar. She avoids the contact. And that definitely made solid impact. Sharp chop. DDT. Headed to the top rope. And the top. She comes up empty. One right hand, another, and another. Provided escape plan. Oh, man. Face buster. Ooh. Rolling elbow right on the mark. Uh-oh. That was awesome. Gonna see a new champ. Cover. Yes, they did it. New tag 
Tag Team Champs. Here are your winners. The team of Psycho Sally and Carly Prime. An incredibly impressive showing by this tag team. That's about as perfect an example of tag team wrestling you're ever likely to see. Hey, partner. How you feeling? Uh, like I just learned how to fly? Tag Team Champions? How's that for Psycho? <laughs> Absolute madness. Ooh, that's not a bad team name. I was thinking Psycho Prime. Prime Psycho? Hmm, possible. We'll workshop it. Ah, <sighs> gold suits you, Sally. When we started down this road, you looked like you were about ready to call it a day. Now, you're on fire! Maybe I was. Kev messed me up, but she also taught me something. Brutality! No. Resilience. I'm more unbreakable than I thought. Hmm. I got the titles. We can go where we want. You're thinking Cap and Rhea. Mm-hmm. Me too. Thing is... I have this feeling those two are not in a long-term partnership. I'm just gonna sit back and enjoy watching them tear each other apart. For now? For now. I've seen my share of brutality during my time in the square circle, but you take it to a whole new level. <laughs> Impressive stuff. But a little wisdom from an old-timer. People will start to see you as the one to take out to prove themselves. If you want to send a message, take out a newbie in the PC. Baseball bats, no DQ, really lay it on. Trust me, everyone will think twice before stepping up to you.
Hey, I'm in a bit of trouble. Think you could help me out? Is it something you should be talking to your parole officer about? <laughs> I'm kidding. Besides, I'm no snitch. What's up? Rio was going to have my back in my match with Johnny Gargano, but Mommy had some other business come up. Think you'd be able to be in my corner? Supporting you? I could, but I've also got a lot of respect for Rhea. I may call the shots around here, but Poppy doesn't cross boundaries like that. Don't make it weird. This was Rhea's idea. All right then, but you don't get it twisted. Just because I'm in your corner, doesn't mean I'm gonna be doing the heavy lifting in your match. I understand. You better. I'm not kidding about this. You roll with me, I'm gonna make sure you don't embarrass us. Yes, sir. That's more like it. Dominic has a new woman by his side tonight. The following contest is scheduled for one fall. Making his way to the ring, representing the Judgment Day from San Diego, California, weighing in at 200 pounds. Dirty Dominic! If anything, Cap has proven herself to be even more brutal than Rhea Ripley as of late. I'm not sure about that, but it looks like the captain will be master and commander for the evening. Johnny Wrestling! And his opponent, representing DIY from Cleveland, Ohio, weighing in at 199 pounds, Johnny Gargano! Gargano is no stranger to success. He's main event at some of the biggest events in NXT history. And Johnny's well equipped to continue that upward trajectory on the main roster. Dominic Mysterio can hold his own with anyone. But I wonder if he'll be lacking without Rhea Ripley by his side. As far as replacements go, you could do worse than the captain. Especially with the amount of intensity we've seen from Cap lately. I think Dominic is in good hands. Satellite DDT. into the corner. Caught him right in the jaw. Ugh, what a shot. Stomp after stomp. Relentless. Each of those boots seem to get heavier with each blow. And Gargano with ring awareness. form of offense with that move. What a counter! Take over with a snapmare. Right across the face! Oh, man! Oh, there's some gouging going on. Oh, that's unnecessary. Gargano quickly reverses. Here comes the splash. And he hits the official. 
And it looks like his manager is wasting no time with a steel chair. And Gargano gets beat to the punch. Whoa, leaping through the air. and rethink its strategy. Being put into a perilous position here after each of these vicious attacks. This is just getting uncomfortable at this point. Back and forth, back and forth, looking for the advantage here. Gargano isn't taking this lying down anymore. Yeah, Gargano able to momentarily stop the bleeding, but will he also gain command of this match? What a forearm! hip toss. The close of this match is just ahead. There is no way this can go on for much longer. Gargano needs to harness the energy from the crowd and get back on the right side. This game's about winning at any and all costs. This competitor knows exactly what they want to do. Perched on the top rope. Here it is. Superplex. A relentless attack here on Johnny. And I don't see Dominic relenting anytime soon. Johnny finding an opening. He's reversing the momentum on him. Instant opportunity for Johnny to turn the tides. Nice Japanese arm drag. Oh, oh man. He was elusive there. to the floor. Brought back into the ring from the floor now. Cross body. And now Mysterio has all gears in motion. Johnny's lacking his usual instincts here. The 619. Oh, and that one busted up Johnny. Look at the high Johnny Gargano just couldn't pull out a victory here in this one. And I'm sure this victory only inflated Dominic's ego even more. It's not going to fit in the arena soon.